decides to play around with you. Done with the music? Yeah. Done? Yeah. Watch the game now? Yeah. Cool. We're gonna Let's watch the game now. Sorry. I do apologize. <laughs> so, jumping into this match though, strike. Defense sided in my in opinion. If Grant win it, they're probably gonna pick attack, knowing the silly mistake they made a lot of time. No, I mean attack <laughs> attack could be the favorable side. I mean, why not? See but now my question is, are, are they actually knifing again? Yeah, I think they are knifing again for sides. Yeah, they will be. Because I was worried for a second that they're just gonna be picking uh, just because what you, sometimes happens is that the losing team will be able oh, to man. pick sides. I thought they were gonna have a disco party again in, 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 in the, the garage. In the, garage. <laughs> the disco. Vikings looking strong though, the man advantage in the knife, two man advantage as Wizard, your last man standing, Evo going for him, and uh, should be an easy one for all three to finish off, we do see two five Kings plays left, let's see how do we look on the knife round, nope, they already restart very quickly, already too late, so five Kings are actually going to play defense, they won the knife, they're taking defense, they're not going to be playing anything silly, not no, falling uh, around, oh no, what is this? Yeah, like I said, attack. What? What? what are okay, we doing? so we're being proven wrong on different levels. I think. I don't know if fucking are confused or not. Death. Okay, no, I think Grunts were just messing about a bit. They're going to be playing. Um, they're going to be playing on the defending side. Grants on attack. Rick, take us away. I'll take you away. I'm going to pick it up with Wizard, see if he can get any uh, early picks in. Which are going to be uh, be pivotal in this game. He's yeah, gonna go uh, towards the uh, B side. Perhaps gonna try and pick uh, towards the bombs. No, he's not. He's gonna check out his nade towards the uh, flower side. Petrolish. Gonna try and get some picks over there. Scoping in just now, but can't seem to land any uh, anything as no one is actually peeking. And we do have uh, a interesting. Uh, Interesting push here from uh, Grant with going towards B and Delita picks off double kill to Blues and Dins absolutely destroying the Grant lineup. And Vado does himself the return kill to Samuel G now pushing towards the B bomb and dropping the bomb on the stairs. Now adding, trying to hand off Dax, but Delita will pick him off. Delita with a hat trick of Rex and a George Foreman to Wizard. It's all left up to Neil K, and he's not in the position to clutch this one. He's still over at the balcony. He did get spotted as well. And Tech gonna go for a quick jumping shot, but he's running out of ammo. Gonna have to reload. It's it's just not happening, man. Is is it? Thirty seconds left, and the bomb nowhere near him. Charge down now. The leader goes down, nearly getting that second frag, but. If he had gotten that second one, I would just have been highly impressed. Just it's not going to go that way. Delete up four frags to start off the match. I mean, they won the knife. They chose defense, and they actually won the opening round on the side they chose. Unlike Granted in the last, uh, in the last map. Take it over, Denzio. Going to see Granted have a quick little push over towards that B side. Quick frag onto Samuel G as he keeps pushing towards B side. Blau taking out Dex, but not for Dex. Got a frag onto Veto. Denz running in as he watches his own nade kill Delita. Azuma and Evo have now got to try to bring this one back. Dins denies any possibility of Evo. Sorry, Azuma getting in there. Nielsk finishes off Evo. 1 1 and granted win that run rather convincingly after only losing uh, Veto. Yeah, indeed. That, that was a fast push and uh, that was actually a su successful B push from uh, Granted coming out. Now Dex is going to be watching uh, this B cross, but in fact, Granted are opting to go towards uh, A this time. And a pretty fast push here from uh, Granted with Din picking up the first one onto Evo. He was pushing down uh, the garage side. As Blues with the bomb, not having the SMG in fact. Now, Zuma shut down Blues actually through the smoke, <laughs> which is quite good, but still, Granted have uh, got control over this A side. As uh, Din will be there in support of uh, any bomb carrier coming in, but we do have a uh, minor issue once again. There we go, we are back. It is still a 4 on 4 wizard scoping in towards that double palm area, picking off the leader. Now Dex is going to drop him, of course, because he knew his position. Dins trying to charge someone down, but it is in vain. And still no bomb down yet. Perhaps Granta didn't just have any smokes left. Down to 2 on 3. Grant are on the back foot right now, which looks to be like a great round. Fado's gonna try and redeem Grant at Ford and Samuel G goes down by him, uh, by his SMG. 
This man Dex left up alive. He might pick up Tins. Tins a little bit over peaking. Explosives now on his own. Gonna have to go big against the two five kings members. Gonna go peaking. Yeah. Frag onto Dex, but Dex will come on top, and that's a fantastic retake from Five Kings, just playing it cool. Lovely color frags there to finish off the run. Zoom and Dex playing cool, yeah, as you said, and able to Explosive finish it off. Evo, yet to get fragged this game. Three runs in. Now, everyone always says this comment is curse. Uh, let's give Evo some love and see what he's doing. Backspoil with SMG in hand, uh, probably gonna make his way towards Garage or into A. As he throws the smoke towards Mid Street, making sure no one's gonna be rushing his teammates. Although Dins is abusing the smokes that the enemy has been throwing for him. Um, but it doesn't look like it's going to happen. They play it toward mid. Evo peeks over that wall. A couple of shots come from Vato and he does drop to them. As one member of peace is done per team. Uh, drops bomb lower overlook. And that's going to make his way towards top A. He should be able to find light near that statue area. Neil's getting a little bit tagged up. As uh, he then falls back. Regens. And Blau has been spotted. Position given away. He's got to be careful though because uh, I was about to say this guy is still up for five kings. And as I say it. Death rings true and takes out Blau. Good team communications there to be able to communicate there. Just spotted that player. And Dex, wow, again, takes out Wizard. Niels gone to Azuma to try and redeem something for team. But Vato and Niels now need to uh, work together to try and get this bomb down. Making the way over towards that A side to try and go for the cross and hope for the best that Dex doesn't get him. Somehow alive for the first half. Gets through on the second part. Lots of shots coming in from the front of A. He's going to have to run on his team to try and hold. Uh, hold them back. Goes for the bomb plant. No one is coming in just as of yet. And he will actually get the bomb plant down uncontested. Niels sitting towards front A. He's going to have to watch out for a bit of fire coming in from Garage. Unable to stop it though. Delete to finish them off. Now the rest of five kings are going to be moving in. Surrounding Vito. There's literally nothing he can do in that position with that many players coming at him. 30 seconds left to defuse. They only need seven. So uh, easy round for five kings. 3-1 your scoreline. And granted looking to be struggling at uh, the beginning of this half. Get another defuse for uh, Five Kings, and they just seem to play it so well. They just leave A open pretty much, and then just go ahead and defuse the bomb. That's what they do, they're the counter terrorists. Quite ironic. As uh, Granted, once again, opting to go to for a fast A push, Wizard and Neil K. Gonna open up the frag count for this round. The leader and uh, Evo both down. As uh, Bins is watching the uh, B Bins. Uh, Meanwhile, Dax getting up a double kill and a double headshot, in fact. Wizard and Niels K dead. And now, Uzuma and Dex gonna have to go big as Blues plants the bomb. Dins picks off uh, Samuel G, and meanwhile, as well. Uzuma did shut down Dins and Dins. Shouldn't be there, man. Fado picks off Uzuma on the hands of uh, Dex. Yes, your last man. Scope and uh, AK-47 in hand, but doesn't matter. Vader will deal down from the B bins. From the A bins, sorry. It's going to make it 3-2. Can Granted sort of pull this one back? Mm, I think you're asking a very rhetorical question. It's it's, it's, it's difficult for them. <laughs> I mean, they're on the back foot, on the attack side. Samuel J opens up with an aid on Tivator. So they struggled a lot towards the end of the last map. I don't know how their mentality is feeling now as they uh, come into the first half of this map. The man down at the moment is trying to make their way over towards that B site. Wizard it takes out Samuel G. It looks like Granted have set their sights over on the B bomb site. Bomb in the hands of Bowers. He makes his way through the middle of the street. He's got to be very careful to get picked off. It is quite open. We do see lots of fire coming in from their B site. We do have a bit of a graphics glitch for a moment. And we are back. Only thing that's happened is that Dun's taken out Delete, and this is going to open up the B bomb site for Grant to make their way in there. Was it falling back so that he can cover his teammates from the top flower building? Let's uh, look and see what's happening over towards mid as I switch to Azuma. Was it a uh, quickly removes him from the, ma uh, from the round? And now it is all to Evo to try and stop the bomb plant. But no, it was having none of it. Finishes him off. That's 3 3. And that is a very strong attack from Granted going towards their B bomb side. Yeah, I mean, they did pull off uh, one uh, one or two. Actually, one one successful uh, B attack once uh, once again. I mean, that's, that's two B attacks being successfully uh, conducted. Now we do see a uh, calf push coming out from uh, Gondon. Interesting choice there. As uh, Feo and uh, Dins are just going to charge down. And there's actually no one to contest it. Saying that though, even their leader are flanking the Granted uh, players down. They're just making a pincer move around them. <laughs> and that's causing trouble for Granted. There's only two players left up alive in the form of Dins and uh, Wizard. As now it's full.
on to Dins. One on five. Picked it down to one on one on four. Gets himself the first frag. Gets himself the second frag. And the third frag on to Evo. The leader and Sam OG just left up alive. Can Dins be the first man to clutch the one versus five in this land? Can he do it? The bomb's over at A. The leader and Sam OG both sitting on front A. Deagle in hand. The leader. Watching back, Sam OG will pick off Dins. And All it that tension vain. build up. All that tension build up. We got so much food to hope for Dins. <laughs> and then it comes to that. And uh, even Five Kings saying, nice try, but not tonight. Dax will be throwing his nade out towards that B site, making sure no one's coming in from Link. Smoke going out though is going to prevent him being able to stop anything crossing. Vader with the opening nade there onto Evo, preventing the SMG moving into A. Although they do have two of those. But it uh, looks like Vader's going to prevent the other one from doing anything as the Zuru drops now. And this is going to open up the A site completely. Five Kings are locked out. Smoke's probably going to be going up any sec as to try and smoke off double palms. And as I say, it comes true. As if rubbing a magic lamp and making a wish. Delita finishes off Neil. Five Kings, two men down at the moment. It's going to be a difficult one to bring back for them. Uh, especially after being locked out on the site. And granted, are going to sit tight. They know they don't need a peek out. They know it's up to Five Kings to not try and bring this one back. To making his way into the bomb site. He's going to have Dins right in front of him. Easy work as Dins picks him off. Dak making his way in towards front A. Makes a bit too much noise. 4 4 is your scoreline. And granted, still holding it. Even Stevens. Grant do seem to uh, know what they're doing wrong now because they didn't have Niels K sitting on uh, the B link like they did previous round to prevent any pushes from uh, the side from the garage or to, to lock them into this A side and just bomb it out. But this time we do have two quick opening kills from Dex and uh, Samuel G saying that though it was in fact a team kill. As uh, it is a 2 on 4, make that down to 2 on 3 as Uzuma picks off Fado. Zuma and Dax left up alive one more. I mean, we have seen seen them these two players do it before. As uh, the bomb's not been planted yet this time. So Zuma's gonna be sitting in quite deep. Dax will be there in support, but he's not convinced he knows where the ground players are, so he's gonna secure his own ass first. Slowly but surely Granted will begin their sold on A. Looking back to Uzuma. Waiting uh, to receive the uh, grant of play. Dax will do that first though. Blues down. Uzuma just walking away at the wrong time. Still alive. 28 seconds left. Granted have to make a push. They have to. So time's ticking away. Uzuma picks off Wizard. It's him down. Niels K with a lovely return frag through the bin. Dex versus Niels K. Dex will pick him up through the bomb. Easy work. Picks no up worries. Perfect. Under the bomb, dude. Always see someone's feet through that bomb site. Always an annoying bomb site to try and get the bomb down on. Looks like quite an even uh, score breakdown looking at both of the teams. Both of the teams have got a player on 3, 5, and 7. The only difference being that. Uh, wow, Vates has got one kill more. It's literally a kill difference between these two teams. That's quite something. Now we do see Dex making his way towards the back of a spot player there on statue, but all he can do is watch Azuma and Evo drop in front of him. And they're now diminished by two players. Spot player towards front eight on the garage. Oh, lovely little wall bang as he takes off Ato. Niels with a quick return frag. He's quite good at that one, as mentioned in the last round. Niels K on form to get the return frag. Although, this is your last man standing, and he's probably not in the best position to try and recover this one. See. Then he's still sitting back. He's made no press towards that A site. And Grant by no means have any reason to try and peek out and go and find him. And looking in a, a few arbitrary places. Not really sure why he checked front A in, the, uh, in those spots. Dunn's going to finish him off, make it 5-5. And I think this is where the big difference is going to come in. Is whether either of these two players, uh, two teams can take it to 7-5. Or if we're going to be sitting with a 6-6 half. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I hope Grant will take it 7-5. Simply because of the fact do want to see a third map. You don't want Five Kings to just walk it away easily uh, in the upper bracket final. As we are uh, continuing, we have granted pushing uh, towards the B bomb. And 
Neil's K picks himself up the first back onto Uzuma. Who's being tagged up slightly. Then, sir. Uh, making his way slowly. He gets caught the first player. Samuel G. How did he not see him? Niels K picks himself up the second frag of the round. The leader down. Dex and Evo, the two Polish in the lineup. Dex with the first frag onto Vado. Two on four. Can they still pull this one back? The ball not be planned yet, remember? So perhaps there's still some sort of hopes for five kings to bring us to a 7 5 scoreline. Dax will shut down Dins as well. Wow, just dealing down. And Evo onto Niels K and. No way are they granted, bringing this back. Granted, I oh, just. No way are they bringing this away. back. Dax, a hat trick of the Eagle Frags. Wizard does come in the back, picking him off. And now it's a 1 on 1. Oh, that Nate's gonna that, do it. That Nate's gonna do that it. That Nate's gonna do it. Gonna do the oh, trick. brilliant! <laughs> wizard! Oh, that was oh, amazing! Always Wizard. With, remember on Crossfire? When oh my gosh. Wizard always with those that key nades in a one on one. Was so, so, Experience. so well done. I mean, wow. No, that was just a brilliant way for him to finish off that round. Glimmer of hope to put his team uh, two rounds in the lead uh, as they move into the half. Now, uh, we see Dex making his way to watch the middle of the street. Scope in hand, spots a player on overlook. Looks like it's going two players down for Grant. have got a granted player over onto that A side. I want to believe it is Dins, and it is. Wizard takes out Samuel. Does a lovely deagle onto Evo to bring it back to three on three. And they're going to get on that side. They've got to watch for Nades. They don't want to stack up that bomb site. Explosives. Wizard rings of a shot to take out Dex. Oh, but he gets taken out by Zuma front end. Last two players for granted are sitting on that A site. We've got Delita and Azuma. See if they can square off this half and make it 6-6. Coming in from Cafe, Azuma should be able to see Dins sitting right up against that wall in the corner. As his teammate equally on the other side. Oh no! Oh yes, yeah, sorry, Delita's taken out Dins. And now Azuma moves in onto that side. Gets taken out by Veto. Gonna go and try and go for the defuse. He actually has, should be able to defuse from behind the bomb. But no, Grant to get the 7-5 half, half. And that is it. Change sides quick. We're gonna be able to see if Grant can pull this one back to a third map. Indeed. All right, the second half of the second map, Five Kings versus Grounded, upper bracket final. Five Kings are on the attacking side. They're two rounds down. Good to see Grounded taking those two rounds in. As Dax was uh, going for some quick peeks here. Towards the double palm area, Evo. Not uh, wanting to take the bomb towards B and Y's decision. Dins will open up onto Samuel Gido. So Grounded or any advantage, make that just a little bit of more of an advantage as Dax goes down to Blues' AK. Blues is holding B, uh, B side. Like the man he is. To lead it up with a nice eagle onto Fado. I've seen him do it on that crossfire as well. Who does get frackled to Niels K, but Niels K did get frackled to Evo before that. Now gonna smoke for uh, Zuma to make his way towards the A side. The leader kind of set up there. As Zuma makes his way down there, this goes down to uh, Zuma's grenade frag. The leader literally next to each other, and Wizard again. Wizard with his nade, and now it's a one on one. And Wizard doesn't have his nade this time to clear it all out. And Wizard is gonna slowly but surely move his way out there. And the leader planted. is planting the ball. One on one. The leader going to be looking around there. Will pick off Wizard. It's going to make 7-6. Still one round advantage for Granted, but we do see Five Kings picking up that first round on attack. Let's have a quick look over at Dex. Going to check a nade towards the A side. And a smoke to... Uh, Provide some cover for his teammates, but no, K 
capitalizing on it just as yet. The leader can with his deagle, just deagling down from a mile away. Nice shot from Dax on to Vado. Vado did uh, get himself a frag, but a 3-on-3 three three now. As uh, Niels K being left quite alone on a does pay dividends for him. We zoom it down, Dax on to Niels K. Wizard goes down as well to Sam OG. 1-on-1 -on -one now as Blues takes off Sam OG. Dax versus Blues. Dax has got to go ahead and plant the package. Blues will uh, surely but surely know now as Dax has just planted the bomb. Gonna go into a... Uh, the most obvious spot as it is. Bruce goes down, Dexter touches it. As obvious as it may be, it doesn't really matter. got their frag. Guys, my mic was all there for a second, so I spoke into nothing. But yeah, I mean, Dex, even though uh, obvious position as it may be, it was not counted at all. Sam G with a nade on two, Wizard. As Dins takes out Azuma, SMG onto SMG, 4 on 4, no, make that 4 on 3, Vader having something else to say as he drops Evo, now <laughs> having to watch right below him. Looks like we have 5 King actually making their way towards that bomb site. as Delita trying to lead the front into the site. Very slow movement from both of these teams, They both of them are really trying to just look for an opening frag at the moment. But not oh, has been spotted, Dex should not have missed that shot, that is not... That is really not like him to have missed that shot. We'll see. I'll have to try and find any other lateral around there. Smoke goes up to see if they can uh, try and draw any of the enemy, any fire, or maybe any uh, uh, any nades to come into the smoke to try and prevent the plant. Grant is still the man strong as they wait for Five Kings to make that move onto their B bomb site. So he's trying to play it slow, although Grant have been quite patient in these runs and I have no reason to peek out. Samuel G gets quite heavily tagged up. As Delita now decides to make his move towards the new bomb site. Niels takes out Sam G. Now Delita makes his way into the hold. Into the top of the B building. No, Dun stops the plant. Delita to frag, but there's only 10 seconds left to find either three frag at the bomb down, and neither of those are going to be possible. And Niels finishes off Delita. 7 8 to scoreline, and granted, take around lead. Finally, granted, take around the defensive side. We do have uh, five kids already taking two rounds on attack, so. It is uh, looking promising still for 5 King, I must say. As uh, they're going to be opting to go towards his A side this time. Delita with a double kill. Hello, Delita. Fado and Dins down. They're going to chuck a smoke out towards the bin area. Going to clear out even more. Ooh, getting attacked, but not the frag. Salmo G will. Evo as well to Niels K. Blue, your last man. And it's a 1 on 5. Who do you see now as. Uh, one versus five, yeah, as you mentioned. Takes out Sam G. But he's going to have a lot on his hands to be able to finish this round off. There we go. Evo takes him out. 8-8 eight, eight scoreline. All even Stevens. Looking over the scoreboard, two top players for each team is going to be Dins and Dieter. Both SMG 17 apiece. And uh, we do see Dieter throwing his nade out towards garage area. Got to watch out for the nade trying to prevent him getting into position. There's a play moving through the smoke. It's Blanc going to finish him off though. Good smoke coming in from uh, from both of these teams, but it looks like they're helping each other in the sense of uh, being able to push into the site. Azuma moves forward, Evo takes out Niels with a reply frag, as they're going to go for their bomb plant. Only Blau and Wizard left. Oh, but there's actually one on the site. Who is it? It's Blau. Takes out one, although Dex gets a re revenge frag. Wizard is now your last man standing. He's laying down in the smoke, AK in hand. Oh, he has spotted one. Oh, yes, he's got the frag onto Dex. Position given away though, and he's going to go up against an SMG. An SMG that knows roughly where he is. It's not going to be an easy one for him to get. Laying down towards the front of the bomb site, Wizard makes his way forward. Sneaking his way up forward. Evo's not expecting this to his right hand side. I'm not sure he's spotted. They're both crawling up on each other at the moment. Oh, and I think the one's just gone around the corner of the other one. Has he been spotted? Yes, he has. Wizard finishes off the frag rather easily, and that's going to be granted, grabbing himself another frag. Oh, sorry, another round, pushing it to 9 8, keeping them the one run in the lead. 9 8 it is. And again, granted with a defuse. Yeah. It is up to uh, Five Kings to uh, get us around back in. Pick it with Dex. And he's going to be looking to get a fast pick in towards the double palm area. Nearly landing it. So, 
Sorry, we just had a little bit of fun. <laughs> so one member down for Rada, Fado. As uh, Wizard picks himself up, uh, return frag onto Hazuma. Nice shot from Dax on the wizard. That's a nice flick shot. Let's see, uh, do some more jumping scope shot in. Picks himself up the frag onto uh, the leader with a grenade. So, two on two. Blues evening the odds onto Samuel G. Explosives planted. So, uh, beginning his assault towards the uh, garage side. Can try and uh, get a defuse in as the bomb goes down. Uh, check the smoke for blues. And in fact, we do have that uh, Dax hat and Evo having a crossfire set up. But due to that smoke, that wasn't possible. But Dax, nevertheless, to the rescue, picks himself the double frag to close it out. 9 9. And it's going tip for tat. 23 frags sitting on Dex. Top player at the moment, 4 5 kings. Evo not looking so good. He did reconnect at the half. So, uh, he's a bit excused only having four frags. But, oh, Din's taken out. Oh, sorry, Sammy taken out by Din's is exploding. Now, Delita quickly picks up a frag on Tevato. Trying to prevent any pushes into that A site from the defending granted players. They are now expecting Ace to come in. Lovely Nate there from Delita to drop onto Nielsk. And they should be able to get cross in and get this bomb down. Blau and Wizard, your last man standing for granted. Blau spots one towards the market area in the middle of the street. Giving away his position with a whole lot of rounds going out. Next takes out Blau with your last man standing. And that's going to be five kings taking the lead now. 10 9. It's getting close. Five kings in the lead once more. After a while. As uh, they are going to be opting to go towards A this time. Once again, actually. And this time with a cafe push. So I'm gonna pick it up with Izuma spearheading the attack, but is it being flashed in the face? And for some quite considerable time, actually. And he did manage to retreat in this flash. This did go down with the opening frag. Now, this uh, push from Five Kings has been truly put to a halt. I mean, they did go all in on that calf push, but it didn't just work out. Now, Grant have been allowed to uh, set up with a man down. Still, nevertheless, they have the time to set up. As Dax uh, shuts down Niels K. That's Dax, the leader onto Vado. Just two more plays up for uh, Gronda. They just seem to be falling like lies when Five Kings finally start to move in. As Wizard take up quite a lead and fragged by the leader. All in the hands of Blues. And it's not very likely it will happen, but he will get himself the first rack. Not gonna happen, of course. He might well pick him off from the back. 11-9. And uh, five kings are starting to pull this one away. The two-round advantage. I was about to say, it's a, it's that bit of a break that they need. A bit of a, a damper zone, if anything. Giving themselves a bit of comfort to work with. Oh, Dex nearly landing this shot onto Wizard. Wizard very quickly moving away. He's not gonna risk anything on there. Niels AK on statue takes a deleter. Vader getting a frag onto Azuma. Eva responds with a frag onto Nielsko of his own. And Sam G also getting one onto Blau. And again, all evened up. Eva doesn't have to worry too much about it mid at the moment. As a, there's only one player in there. Five Kings looked like they were making their way over towards B side, but are bringing the bomb back towards A after the succession of frags that fell down on that side. Deck watching mid. Drops the bomb uh, on the one side of the street. I need to go pick, pick it back up again. Wizard has made his way all over towards the, the flower area on B as he had a little suspicion that there might be a player and he's not wrong. Takes out Samuel G. Five Kings reduced to two players versus three. Dex going to go for the plant. I do see Evo getting tagged up on statues. He's going to have to lay it down. He needs his teammate with him. They can't do this one. Uh, they can't do this one without each other. Dex lands a shot onto Vatus. Let's stuff. Wizard now going to throw an aid onto that bomb side. Evo lands a shot onto Dins. Wizard, your last man standing. His net doesn't connect. He does find the frag to Evo though. And now we have one on one. Scope on scope. Have they spotted each other? I think Wizard has actually spotted him. Shots coming in in his direction. It's going to be very careful. He's only got a D to work with. Oh, lands a frag onto, De oh, onto Wizard. 12 9. Three match points. Three game points. Three. Land final points in the hands of Five Kings right now. Indeed. Wow. I don't think many people were expecting this. I mean, Dex, 
Dex went absolutely big. I think it would win him for this round. Perhaps the final round as Uzuma picks off Neil K with his grenade. Wizard back to Evo. Samuel G onto Wizard. Count frags are happening. As uh, Granted didn't manage to get a return frag in for the 3-3. Three three. Now it is. Boost will wake up. Samuel G dead. Dex going to be looking around the corner. Moving in towards the statue area. Checking out the smoke. He's got two players. Right around him. As Uzuma has been tagged up, Dex will push around, picking up the AK, but Denz will get the better of him just in time. Uzuma not being able to support the Dex just as well. As the leader comes in the back, picks off Blues. Deagle out, now trying to look for uh, the leader. Gonna be uh, looking to push to get away to Uzuma. The leader being a little bit caught out, but the leader will get the winner. 39 your score. And they will advance towards the grand final. That's it. They've secured themselves a seat in the in the the final bid to take home the number one prize. I mean, at this point, they essentially secured minimum second place because even if they lose yeah. in the grand final, they get second place. So what this means for them is that they have a map advantage going to the grand finals when they play the best of five. So uh, they have the t they have a bit of an easier task trying to win it. Uh, towards the end. Now, of course, granted, aren't entirely out. It is a double elimination, which means they have a chance to come back through the lower brackets, which will still be played tonight. But I'm not sure we're going to be casting any more of that because uh, it's, it's it's a bit late. We're a bit tired. We may do. We'll see. We'll see. We'll, we'll get see. back to you. We'll keep if, you the, if the stream stays live, we're probably going to be commentating it. Other than that, guys, if you want to follow me, I am Menace. You can check me out on Twitter at Menace or on Facebook. I am Menace FPS. Alongside me, I have Rick. Rick Hill Four. Rick Pod Four Twitch. Twitch. Rick Pod Four on on Twitter. Explanation mark cast us and you've got all sorts of There you go. Details. Exclamation mark cast us if you do want to find any more information about us or if you guys want to follow us and check us out. We'll of course be updating those pages with any matches that do still go ahead tonight. Other than that guys, until next time we'll be chatting soon. Goodbye.